Hello. Hello. Speak to the youngest female, 18 years of age or older, who, who lived in this household, who is at home now. Yeah, you're talking to her. That person of... Great. And first of all, I want to talk to you about a few issues that impact the United States of America. All right. Just for background, purpose, just for background purposes, in which state do you reside? Illinois. You're in Illinois? Oh, I'm sorry. That's where I moved from. I'm in Florida now. Okay. And are you registered to vote in your precinct or election district or not? I sure am. Now, thinking ahead to the general election, if the elections for U.S. Senate were held today, and the candidates were Bill Nelson, the Democrat, and Rick Scott, the Republican, who would you be more likely to vote for? Well, since I don't want nobody telling me what to do with my body and my unborn child, I have to vote for Rick Scott. And is your mind made up about who you will vote for? Or is it possible you would change your mind? Oh, wait, I got that wrong. Rick Scott says I can't. He tell me I, got, I can't kill my baby. If I won't kill my baby, I got to vote Democrat. Who is that other one? Bill Nelson, the Democrat. But he just creeps me out because he's so skinny and he's got them beady eyes. Who are you going to vote for? I'm a neutral party, man. Hmm. Hey, I guess you could just talk me up as undisguided yet. <laughs> Understood. I ain't... And as of today, do you lean more... Do you lean more towards Bill Nelson, the Democrat, or Rick Scott? If you had to choose one person to lean towards today. Well, if we're if I had to choose one as far as who I'd rather take me out on a date, Rick Scott, just probably because of the Navy hat. I got a thing for servicemen. Um, so I'd probably today, because it's a Friday and I get frisky, probably lean towards Rick Scott. I appreciate that. And is your mind made up about who you will vote for? Or is it possible you would change your mind? Well, Bill Nelson came at me sideways with a nice offer and maybe some Victoria's Secret. I could probably swing his way. So would you say your mind is made up or you might change your mind? Yeah, I'd probably change my mind. I'm, I'm wishy-washy, you know how we women are. And if the election for governor were held today, and the candidates were Ron DeSantis, the Republican, and Andrew Gillum, the Democrat, who would you be more likely to vote for? Hmm. That's a toughie. Hmm. I'm undecided. And... As of today, do you lean more toward Ron DeSantis, the Republican, or Drew Gillum, the Democrat? Um, I'd probably write in the candidate, because both of them fellas, I just, I don't know. I know what uh, Gillum, he's talking about giving Medicaid to 800,000 folks. Where's the money going to come from? How are we going to pay for all that? And DeSantis, he's up there with, with Pence and his wife and standing up there thinking he's so cool just because he knows the, you know, the vice president. But still, I just don't understand where Gilliam thinks we're going to get all the 